This is Zeus Watch video. Sir, who are you? Uh, my name is Fyodor from Insecure.org and the Nmap project. What's the purpose of Nmap? The main purpose of Nmap is a network discovery and analysis tool. So you can use it to find out what systems are up and available on your network, what services they're offering, um, what sort of firewall and filtering rules might be in effect. Yes. What's the main feature of Nmap? I guess I would kind of say it has five main features if that's allowed. First it does the host discovery where it finds out which hosts are up and alive on the network. Then it takes just those, five, those alive hosts and it does port scanning of them. So it will scan as many as 65,000 ports of TCP and of UDP to try and figure out what port numbers are open and those are services listening for communication. The next one it does is version detection. So it says, oh well port 80 is open but what's actually application is listening there. So it might say, oh, 80, the open port 80 is the Apache web server running it out, or maybe the port 22 is open SSH, SSH server, or maybe someone's being sneaky and the port 80, instead of being HTTP, is some peer-to-peer -peer file sharing protocol that they thought they could sneak by by running it on an unusual port number. And then the fourth thing it does is OS detection. So we say, oh, is this a Windows box or a Linux box or Macintosh and what version number and map tries to figure out. And then the fifth thing and our newest thing is the Nmap scripting engine where it can say, okay, Nmap figured out all this information discovered on the network, but let's take it a little bit further. Let's take the SSH server and uh, try and find out if it's using an easily cast password. Or uh, let's take the IP address and figure out who the owner is by checking the regional registries. Yeah, that's awesome. Oh, uh, Corbin, uh, could you give us a sneak preview of what's cooking, what's coming, what's coming up? Something okay. new, something hot. Yes, I think our, we have two things that have really been a super focus right now. One is the Nmap scripting engine, where we now have 230 scripts that can do everything from vulnerability detection to scraping a website and trying to find SQL injection bugs to more discovery things like figuring out with the DHCP server what hosts are on the network. And so we plan to continue expanding that as fast as we can. And then we've also been really focused on IPv6. The June 8th was World IPv6 Day, and we participated by making a new MMAP release where it could do raw IPv6 scans. Uh, MMAP.org now has an IPv6 address that you can visit in a web browser if you have IPv6 yeah, too. That's great. And we run a machine called scanme.mmap.org, which also now works with IPv6. Gordon, we really appreciate your contribution. Really, really. Thanks so very much. Great. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Gordon. All right.